also there's a young man who I picked up in the street. You've heard the story before. He's back again. I think this is his third time. Sam is, Hardy, yeah. how are Hello, you? I'm very well, thank you, Gabby. How- Thanks for having me back. Oh, it's lovely to see you. Um, now, you're the young man that made everybody stop in their tracks because I think your guitar playing is phenomenal. You went to Spain, you recorded an album. You've now got a new album out, haven't you? Yeah, that's why I launched last time I was here. But I've already written another album, so I'm ready to record that in... I know winter, late winter, sometime. <laughs> well, you're going to be you're going to be in the same studio as the man who's played with Paul McCartney I on know. guitar and That's pretty impressive. Chaka Khan. Uh, but quite frankly, I think uh, you knock the socks off all the people. Now here we go. We're going to be doing a live show, but I'm not allowed to say it on air. Okay. Uh, and I would love you to come and do one track on our live show, but I cannot tell you when it is. Simon, don't okay. do your computer because we can all hear you going tippity tippity <laughs> tap tap tap. You can do your computer afterwards. Also, my little girls here, Emily. Hello, but, Emily. Um, Hello, say hello. Shout out hello. Hello. Yes, she's here. She wanted to come in to see Sam Hardy because she learns a guitar and I said he's one of the most phenomenal guitarists that has ever been on the show. Uh, Sam, what are you going to play for us first of all, my love? It's a new track that's going to be on the new album. It's called Intervention. Thank you.
Thank you. Really, really lovely. There you go. Do you know what I love it when you do the really just just the thing that I know I ask you every single time that you come yeah. in when you do the that's going to happen you... later. Oh, sure. is it? <laughs> I've got just the song for you. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Okay. Sure. I, I love the way you do that. Um, now my little girl came in. Uh, she's eight years old. It's Emily. I've got my other ones at home. Um, LJ. But but. Emily uh, has been learning guitar for a while. How long does it take to be able to play the guitar like you play? Uh, well, I, I was practicing for like seven years till I was 21, and then I had seven years off, and I've been back playing two years now. No! Yeah. I Why took, did you have seven years off? Because um, I used to be in a heavy metal band, and we were, you know, we all went our separate ways, and I sort of resented guitar for a while, and I wanted to follow other things, so... Uh, what did you do in the heavy metal band? I played guitar, lead guitar. But it was different, it was thrashing. It was heavy, yeah. So we were called Dark in the Sun, and uh, we were from Pembrokeshire, and we used to play all over the place, played up in Bridge End with Bullet for My Valentine and all those sort of people in the Toll House. And So, yeah, it was a good experience. What's <laughs> it, what a difference, though. A complete difference, yeah. Because I, I, I'm not um, a sort of heavy metal fan and a, a no. rock fan, but, <laughs> but and people are very passionate about it, aren't they? Yeah, they do. It's, um, it's like a cult, almost, but it's... Uh, it's a good way to express yourself if you're feeling uh, rebellious as a teenager, I suppose. <laughs> Do you think that's what it's about? Because the, what you play now is seems to be from the heart. Is, yeah. is it metal from the heart? It's from the heart, but I used to vent a lot of my frustrations, and that's exactly so you'd get into it. It was just, yeah, it was a good release of energy, that's what I would say. And it, there's no energy uh, concert than a metal gig. It's just the energy that's incredible. It's just... <laughs> I've, never, I've never... Actually, no, I, well, Guns N' Roses I've been to. Is that... Is that yeah, well, it's, that's yeah, it's rock. heavy rock, yeah. So they, they had amazing energy. Obviously, they're one of the best bands ever. That but. was great fun. <laughs> I enjoyed that, Simon London. <laughs> yes, I'd let me turn your mic up so people can hear you. I've just broken a nail on you. Oh, no. I don't know how I did that. <laughs> uh, uh, Simon London, have you ever been to a heavy metal concert? No, I've never been to a heavy metal concert, but as a kid, I was a real fan of Iron Maiden. Exactly, yeah. Iron really? Maiden, incredible. Yeah, I had that album, The Number of the Beast, yeah. which is a great great album they did but it's a lot of shouting isn't it yeah yeah but also they are brilliant guitar players as you see you, you know you look at somebody like slash is a yeah. is an amazing guitar player and it's when you say that you're in a heavy metal band and then you can play guitar like that it, it doesn't surprise it me at you. all yeah. well, my last song sounds uh it's, it's arabic and spanish but it'll sound more heavy metal <laughs> oh, <laughs> you, really? see where, you see where my roots came from from the yeah but it sounds great yeah i think i'm scared so. already <laughs> uh, sam hardy if people want to find you where can they find you yeah they can find me on my website at samhardymusic.com or on twitter sam at, you know at sam hardy music and instagram and yeah sh music 84 so Wonderful, thank, thank you. you. And you'll be here throughout the show, which is lovely. Great. You're going to be playing again at the top of the next hour and the top of the next hour. But delighted uh, to welcome back Sam Hardy. Hello, Sam. Hello, Gabby. Let me Hello, turn everybody. the mic up. There we go. Now, uh, yeah. Sam, you're sitting next to Mr. Average White Band, Hamish Stewart, who produced the album Men United for Prostate Cancer UK. We're going to play a couple of tracks from that. Hamish, it's lovely to have you here today. And the two of you playing together, that really was quite something. Simon London is here from kidrated.com. And I'm here too. And I cannot wait because you're going to play the, the thing that one of the tracks that made me stop in my tracks, literally. Yeah. This is uh, the one I always, if anyone see me busking or open mic night, they would have heard this. It's called Arabian Skies. It's beautiful. Thank you. So. <laughs> Thank you. 
Shukran. Wow. Thank you. There you go. Thank you very much. Do you know, I love that bit when you do that. The last bit. Yeah, the, 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 the shredding. What, is that what it's called? <laughs> it's called shredding. It's where what, pretty much every guitarist does in heavy metal. Oh, really? So, yeah. What, but the, they do it in Spanish guitar as well. Yes, but the, the little, when you do the, the really... The, the, the just a... Yeah. Yes, yeah, shredding. Like, it's just, you know, alternate picking 16th notes and, yeah. But, um, Are Paco you speaking Lucia English? Do, yeah, well, oh, musical good. terms. Hamish would know. But Paco de Lucia used to play with his fingers. He, it was just something else. It was just, yeah. So that was rapid. beautiful, though. You, that you. was really beautiful. Hamish. Very good. What did you, what did you think there? The man himself, Hamish, what did you think? What? Don't that do was that. good. How do you do that? <laughs> <laughs> He's good. Thank uh, Sam, thank you very much. Thank We're going to be hearing much. more thank from you. Sam Hardy at the Great. top Thanks. of the next hour. Really, really fabulous. How lucky are we? Also, Sam Hardy's here to play his last track. Sam, who's the man I literally picked up in the street. He's a busker in London. He's phenomenal. He's done a couple of albums. You can find him at Sam Hardy Music. He is... Uh, 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 somebody has their phone on. We'd like the phones to be off. Thank you very much. Uh, Sam, yeah. what are you going to play for your last track? This is just us? like a traditional sort of Spanish flamenco solia-esque type piece and it's uh, going to Jim Stubblefield Al Marconi and Mark Barnwell who are also great guitarists so let's uh, oh bless you this. Let's thank this. you Gracias. Thank you. Thank you. There you go.
Sam, it's really beautiful. Uh, it's such an incredible, it's a very emotive sound. It really is. And I can't believe that you started out in heavy metal. I there know, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what a difference, what a difference. Are, yeah. are you, uh, it's quite a loaded question, but are you happier playing guitar like this than you were when you were in a heavy metal band? I still play rock and heavy metal at home as well. <laughs> I still play in the bedroom like that, yes. But um, I don't know, I, I, I find my way in this music. I think this has been my best luck so far, so yeah. Well, I'm the very best it. of luck with everything. Thank you very much. Um, and you. if people want to uh, download your album, where can they go to? Yep, samhardymusic.com. And uh, this week I officially sold over a thousand CDs independently since last coming on from your Aww. show. So thank you. Oh, bless <laughs> you. So thanks Listen to everybody out there. Yeah, thank you. Hardy, it's been lovely. Thank you. Lovely to have cool. you here. <laughs> and it's what's really lovely is that obviously Hamish Stewart at City Next to You, who's played with Paul McCartney and Chaka Khan and obviously was the average white band, just had the biggest smile on his face while you were playing. Well, that was really quite something, wasn't it? It was lovely. He had a lovely big smile. Sam, thank you, thank, you. thank you very much indeed.